Welcome to Take It Today. Today on the channel, we're going to be talking about wearables. And I know you're asking what wearables are. Wearables are accessories that you get to wear, where well, that's basically where the name comes from, and get to give you service together with your phone. Uh, these are things like uh, watches, like earbuds, headphones, fitness trackers, and all the things that you get to buy and wear that are tech that you can get to use together with your phone. So today we're going to be talking about wearables. Battery life, they give me good service. The voice quality is amazing. The, the quality on, on call is also very amazing. And these are the buds that I use. But we're not going to be talking about this specific buds because this are on the higher end. We're going to be talking about the Redmi AirDots. Well, they were rebranded and they are now called the Mi True Wireless Buds Basic. So these are what we're going to be reviewing the channel. They go for between 3,000 to 4,000 senior shillings and they give you great service. So stay tuned as we unbox this and I get to give you my hands-on uh, video and experience of using the Me Too Alice Buds. So let's see what we get inside the case. This unbox is very fast. Let's pull it out. So we have the buds themselves. We've got a few tips to change. And you've got the menu. So interestingly, let's just arrange this. So interestingly, they don't give you a charger with uh, the earphones, but it charges with a normal uh, micro USB charging or a micro USB charger. So that's what it charges with. And I think they just assume that you can get that uh, for yourself uh, or rather that you're using something that uses that. But this is the case, this is the case, the carrying case, which also doubles up as a charging case. Uh, it looks very similar to the Samsung Galaxy Buds case, but this is what they give you. This is the new wireless true buds, uh, the, the black. If you want better ones, you can go for the Xiaomi buds. Uh, the, those ones are white in color. So these are what we get. Let's just quickly take a look inside and uh, open and see what we have. So interestingly, these are the buds, the left and the right. So they still have the pieces on. Uh, this is how the case looks. Let's just remove this so that you can get to see uh, the buds. Nice. So it has its charging pins. That's what it uses to charge. This is the current case. It's a 300 milliampere case, or rather, the battery inside is a 300 milliampere. Uh, the battery inside the case, the, the buds are 40 milliampere. It takes you about 1.5 hours or one and a half hours to charge this from zero to 100 while inside the case. And it takes you about two hours to fully charge uh, the case. So this be true wireless earbuds. Well, they call them the basic buds, so they're pretty basic. But they come with Bluetooth 5.0, which means that's that improved stability and connection. And not only that, but you can connect to a device with a Bluetooth 5.0 and pair more than one thing. So you can have maybe your watch paired in, and then you have your buds paired in, and, and they will seamlessly both connect. So that's the advantage of Bluetooth 5.0. If you want to know more about Bluetooth 5, uh, please tell us in the comment section. We can do a separate video just to get to explain Bluetooth 5, where you can get the future uh, of Bluetooth as it advances. But they come with Bluetooth 5.0. They also come with 7.2 millimeter drivers and they come with a DSP and that DSP gives you something they call environmental noise cancellation or stability. Uh, people, uh, you know, this is basically to give you better sound. They are not really active noise cancelling but they give you better sound when you're on call and that's what the DSP is for. The, the, the buds themselves, the earbuds, they give you four hours of playback. Now this each individual pad, uh, they are individual, so maybe uh, if you are sitting next to somebody you can have one bad paired in and then have one bad paired in and you can still get to hear the music. So the bars are independent, all of them charge independently, so even if maybe you lose one bad, you can still get to use uh, the, the, the bars and the charging case because 
all the buds connect uh, differently. So these two buds uh, give you four hours of playback and one if you're traveling with the case, the case will, uh, bag will give you 12 hours of playback. So that means if you are going on a flight or going on a, on a journey, if you have them, that's four hours. If you have the case also, it gives you extended playback and uh, you have your music all through your journey. So that's uh, that's what you get with the Me True Wireless Buds. Uh, they have, they, have they, well, they look classy. Let me just put this on so that you can get to see uh, how they look. They attach magnetically to the case. Uh, but so this is how they look. This is the left bud. As you can see, that's how it looks uh, on your ear. It's very uh, small, so uh, it has a very nice ergonomic design. Uh, so they're small, they fit in your ear well, and uh, hopefully they stay there. So even if you, uh, you're moving or you're exercising, uh, they don't fall. So this one is stuck. Let's try to get it out. Good. So that's it. They give you a sound when they pair. So that's how they look in your ear. They look really nice, uh, they don't fall, they're small, they don't hurt your ear also. And if you have a bigger ear, you can change in with the tips that you get with the box. So this is how they look. They also sound pretty nice, so let me just try and connect them to the phone that I have here, so that you can get to see how uh, it works. So let's try and pair this up. Number one, for you to pair them, you have to remove them from the charging case, otherwise they will not detect. So now once they're out of the charging case, it means they're on. Uh, so I'm just scanning. You can pair them with any device. You can use them for uh, I iOS, so like iPhones. You can use them for Android. In this case, I'm gonna try and test them with uh, an iOS device. Uh, I know there are Apple AirPods for this, but let me just try this. Uh, one of the great things about the Mi Buds or anything that comes from Android is its universality. So let's just uh, scan this and uh, see. So they're really connected with the device. One thing you will note is that the Mitri Wireless Buds, they have an LED uh, light. You can barely see it on the video, but if you had them in hand, you would see it. So when they are charging, the LED light is uh, red. Once they are fully done, uh, the LED turns white. Uh, if they are in pairing mode, also, uh, the LED blinks. It gives you blinks to know that it is in pairing mode, and that's how you can be able to see it on the device. So. As I said, for them to connect, you have to remove them out of the charging case. So once I remove this out of the charging case, it, it is visible uh, to the device, to the phone, and uh, I can basically connect them. Once they're connected, it's uh, all played. So now they are connected. So what happens is, if I double, if I click once, it uh, gets to play the music, to pause the music, it gets to answer calls or decline calls. If I double tap, it summons for me the assistant that comes to the phone. As you can see, there's already uh, it's already someone Siri, and uh, Siri is already working. So if I double tap, it summons the assistant. If I tap once, it gets to play the music, it gets to pause the music. Let me just go to the music app so that you can get to see this. So, for example, I'm just playing a tune here. So the tune is already playing. If I put this in my if I click once, it begins to play the music, and I can hear the music now. If I tap once, it pauses, it stops. If I tap once, it continues to play. If I tap twice, it summons the assistant. So those are some of the features that you can get. I don't know whether you can customize them more than that. So it does, it does it just simply has the one tap and the double tap. The one tap is to play music, pause music, answer calls, uh, and decline calls. Double tap is to summon uh, the assistant, and uh, so if you're on Android, it's gonna summon Google Assistant. Uh, or if you're on Samsung, it's gonna summon Bixby. If uh, you're on uh, iOS, it's gonna summon Siri, and that's very good. And you can actually speak into Siri because it has a dedicated mic. So when you put it on, you have to always make sure that you don't uh, muffle or or cover the the you don't cover the microphone with your ear. That's it. so. Let me just try this. Hey Siri, what's the weather today? So that's very really nice. I can hear whatever Siri is uh, speaking uh, through the earbud, and that's nice. This is the the fit. The fit is amazing. I love the fit on this buds, and they also sound very nice.
So they sound very nice. I actually can't hear what's going around in my what's going around in my environment. I can only just hear what the music is saying, and that's nice. So that's the audio on the Metro Wireless Bus. I tell you, the audio is amazing. It has nice height, it has nice beats, it has nice space. The bass is not, not, not as deep as I'm used to, but the bass is also very good. The music on this is nice. Let me tell you something, a fair warning. When you are full volume on this, don't try going out walking on the streets. You might actually get hit by a car. So let's try call on uh, the device and just get to hear how the audio is. Uh, so that we can be